Welcome back. Before we get started, we'll do a little housekeeping here. Just to let you know that by watching this uh, video, you acknowledge that I am not Gilligan. I'm not the skipper. I'm not the professor. I'm not Marianne. I'm not Ginger. I'm not Mrs. Howell. And I'm not certainly not uh, Thurston Howell the third. And I'm definitely not your financial advisor. By the way, those of you who are old enough to have watched or still maybe watch uh, Gilligan's Island, I mean, that crew, besides the professor who, you know, he got a lot done with a little bit of resources he had, right? And then, you know, Ginger's not hard on the eyes. And Marianne, boy, that's a, she, she, give me Marianne all day long. She, she's, she's, uh, you know, she, she's a cutie pie, you know, just that, that whole small American gal, you know, so I'm all about Marianne from that perspective too. But the Gilligan, he, he does what he does, right? We all have Gilligans in our lives and on our teams, unfortunately. But the skipper, he had to get them out and back for a three hour tour and he couldn't do that, right? You know the whole the old saying that my, my German grandmother used to say, red sky at night, sailor's delight, red sky morning, sailor's warning. You couldn't even follow that. You take this, this, these folks out uh, on a three hour you know, tour and can't get them back. And then the, the other big thing is what is Mr. Howell and Mrs. Howell doing with all that luggage and gear for a three hour tour? Boy, there's something wrong. I, I think Thurston is uh, scamming us. He's a... Uh, He's one of those fake uh, millionaires. Anyway, I'll, I'll, I'll digress. But again, I am do your own research. I'm not your financial advisor. I'm not your friend. I'm just some guy on the internet. I should, I'm showing you my journey. Do your own research. I'm just a data point. So that being said, I'm going to show you some pictures of my, my Lambo. And what I mean by that is my Saab Lambo. Uh, I hate Lambos. And, and again, uh, I'm just showing you where it's, it's a 2009 Saab 97X. Uh, it is paid for. It needs some work done. Uh, you know, I'll show you this one as well. Um, got a crack in the back because we had that when I bought it, right? And yes, it needs a wash. Am I going to pay money for the wash? Not right now. I go a long time in between washes because it's money that I I'm pouring into crypto right now. <laughs> I'm putting everything into drip and these miners to get it going. Look at this. You see this? This is my Lambo. I will get to the point, though, where I can buy a nice car. And it will not be that nasty Lambo. I would get my first one's probably going to be an Audi S8 when I cash flow enough. Uh, you know, uh, Porsche uh, Prayer 911 Prayer Twin Turbo. I would buy uh, I'd buy a Ferrari uh, over a Lambo any day, and and also GM's got their game right with that those new vets that are coming out too. So anyway, long story short is I'm not trying to ball like Stunt of Breezy, uh, like uh, Thomas G, uh, you know, like uh, Ray from Bartertown, all those cats that have been doing this a long time and have the kind of cash flow that can afford to do this right now. I'm not there yet. What, what happens though, is that a lot of time you guys start making, you know, hundred bucks a day and you'll go out and do something stupid thinking that you're a baller. And this is really, uh, you know, what a baller, what those guys look like. This is how their game is right now. All those stunt of breezy and all those guys, this is what they are. Winner takes a 3-2 lead in this opening round series. Morant. Oh! That is Stun of Breezy and those guys in terms of their crypto DeFi game, right? And here is a lot of the new cats that are out there trying to act like Stunna Breezy and play the game like Stunna, and you are not. This is this is what a lot of you cats are doing. Give it a little nod, throw the keys on there. Broken jump shot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but but that that is most of your games that I'm seeing out here with with what you're doing. Listen, keep compounding, keep growing your 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 bags, your stacks until you get there, right? And 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 again, I, I think that we'll get there soon enough. I'm not there yet, but I'm not trying to ball like them either, right? I showed you pictures of my Saab Lambo, that and that that's where that is. So we're gonna move on. We're gonna keep this short. By the way, I'm switching things up in terms of how we're doing these because I want to get you guys in and out uh you know uh, a little bit quicker in, with these videos i want to talk about the animal farm drip network drip garden and the network effect you guys need to research this a little bit more on your own but but listen this we're early we're, we're listen when they first started and launched you know 
the be reap token and now that's being used with uh you know drip network and for the and the network piece it's not a multi-level marketing it's really being meant to be used like this to grow our whole network and ecosystem if you're part of drip right and and when you first start out if you look at the the telephone system with graham bell and the, the other person on the other line you started out with two and you see the the uh, compounding impact it has in terms of the network effect until it just grows exponentially, right? That's where we are right now. We're we're probably here with three or four phones, not even five yet, I don't think, right? And as this thing continues to grow in terms of, and I know we're in the delay with the animal farm, I get that, right? I, I get it's not fun. My money's tied up too. So, but realize how early we are. You guys are dumping and, and don't even understand how early we are, what how awesome this <laughs> this ecosystem is. So I just I just want to encourage you. Um, you know, to just think about that and, and think about where we're going to go. I, you keep seeing new and new, uh, more and more accounts daily, and not only with the, in, in the drip garden too, even though the contracts, you know, going down, you're still seeing more and more people jump in and who get it. And those folks who are selling and, and just dumping and paying that 10% tax to, to claim and 10% tax to sell. Thank you. Uh, the, the paper handed noodle arms that I talk about, They'll come rushing back in, but the rest of us who are continuing to grow this and understand this and continuing to compound, we understand that this is going to morph into this and then even greater, right? And so this is where we are. So I just want to encourage you guys, uh, you know, with this. And by the way, I got to give a shout out to crypto.com again, man. They are so quick to get my money to my bank account and I, I'm not paid. I don't enable comments, right? And, and the reason I don't want to enable comments is because I don't want to hear from guys like Gil who's... Come on, man. You said you were going to show your Lambo and you showed us his old rusty sob. Come on, man. Listen, I don't want to hear from Gil or anybody else about this, right? I'm, that's why I don't, I don't want to manage, uh, you know, a community. And I don't want you guys to get scammed. I don't want to, I posted, uh, you know, something on uh, Stun, one of Stunner's videos the other day. And immediately I got a bot, you know, asking me to sign up for something or click on a link, right? I'm not going to deal with that. And I don't want you guys to get scammed either. So, you know, Gil, I'm going to tell Karen on you if you don't chill out. Yo, are you watching those stupid YouTube videos about the crypto, Bitcoin, and Dogecoin again? Get back to work. Our 401k is in the tank, and I got to get a hair hairdo again. You need to get a better, more overtime and a better bonus this year. Listen, man, I'm not, I'm not dealing with all that. I'm not dealing with people. I, I'm just sharing my journey. That's where we are. So anyway, that being said, I'm going to change things up. I'm going to, starting this coming Monday, I'm going to do um, mine or Monday. And what, what happens here is, is I'm just going to show you all the miners I'm involved in, and I'm going to get ready this weekend. Today, I'm getting a couple of minutes here. I'm going to jump into uh, the BNB Crops Farmer because, and I'm not going to show you guys this. I'm going to get you out of here. I'm going to uh, compound the plants because we're almost at, we're going to hit 18. We should be at about 18,000 when I compound that. But uh, this, listen, the BUSD crops farmer is rolling, bro. I mean, it is, I did the math on this. It's about a buck 25 per uh, crop. Uh, and it's, it's been pretty consistent with that. So this thing is pumping. The contract is growing. They have the mechanism set up so that the contract won't uh, deplete like all the, you know, even baked beans and some of the grist, uh, some of these other ones, are, the contracts are already going down, you know, so I really like this. So I'm going to go ahead and throw uh, another one here in a couple minutes uh, on the BNB Crops Farmer. And I'll cover all the miners on Monday. I'm going to call it Miner Monday. And that's what we'll be doing uh, going forward. Uh, and then on Fridays, I'll do kind of the normal. I'll show you the progress on the, uh, you know, drip network here. You can see that I'm uh, going to compound here. This is my main account. We're at about 22 on the Healing the D account. You can watch the kickoff video if you want to check out what this channel is really about you know, what I started it for, but it's really uh, morphed into a compounding passive income channel. That's what this is about. So let me go ahead and hydrate this, show you guys this, and then get on the road here. Let me see. I'm also, you know, again, continue to be a good citizen with, I've done nothing but uh, uh, compound. I've done 87 times and I'm almost to two drip that I have invested with all the compounding here. So um, I know the price of drip is down, don't really care at this point. So we're at 239. One more, by the end of the day, uh, we'll be at 240 and I'll be making 0.1 drip an hour, which is awesome. So anyway, let's go over here to Piston Token. I'll show you that hydration. 
Piston is, is pumping a little bit here. I'll show you the price. I, I, I got to tell you, I'm impressed. What are we at? 15 bucks. Good job, Piston. I mean, you know, I'm, uh, we'll see where this goes. I'm glad I did get in. I did take some profit on some of the pre-sales uh, pre that I got. So there we go. I'm at 125 Pistons, as you can see. And let me just kind of rotate over here. I'm actually going to go ahead and uh, I'll wait until this clicks over. But, but listen, this thing, I got 84 and uh, this should uh, kick us over to... Uh, 18,000. This thing continues to compound. And, and again, what you can see here, I, I'm thinking that by Monday, I, I'd probably be closer to hitting 20,000 on Monday. And then this thing is going up. I mean, it'll go up a thousand a day once I get to Thursday. You can see our 30,000, not Thursday, once I get to 30,000, which is great. And I know the price that we're not keeping up right now with the you know decay of the plant right now, but when the price does go back with drip and the animal farm kicks in and the piggy bank and all the things that are planned that Forex has planned, we are going to be the beneficiaries of that. And let me just show you real quick while I'm waiting for this, the thing to keep, uh, click over. Right now, this shows you kind of all, where all the wallets are. And so, you know, again, I was at that 10 to 15,000. Now I'm at the 15 to 20. And, you know, starting next week, I'm getting further and further ahead because I continue to compound. I am going to, by the way, once one day a week, I'm going to harvest uh, same time I do on Saturday nights after sundown. Uh, I am going to... Um, uh, go ahead and uh, um, harvest that one day for the from the uh, uh, drip garden so that I can put it into the uh, the animal farm here with that drip BUSD pair that will generate me pigs and dogs eventually. So, all right, let's go ahead and refresh. I should have 85 there. I do. And you guys can see this live. And again, I think this video is uh, going to be a little bit shorter. So plant the seeds. Watch it click over, and then I will cut you guys loose. Uh, I have a big track meet I got to go with uh, my son to this weekend. It's a big invitational. He got he got whooped up on a little bit in the, the four by one and four by two. There we go, eighteen thousand. Now you saw it live. So I am continuing to compound. But uh, anyway, I got that planned this weekend. My daughter has also graduated from college this weekend. Got a lot going on. So I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. I'm going to end it here. Listen, be kind to each other. Be generous. Don't be Gil. Don't be Karen. Uh, be generous to each other. Be generous to people who are serving you and, and, and helping you out with things. You're going to be wealthy if you do this thing the right way and you want it. You should be you should be generous with your time and with your money. And I uh, hope you have great weather where you are. Hope you stay safe and uh, enjoy your uh, weekend. And we will talk to you later.